I really like you. And I wanted to know <laughs> if you wanted to date me. <laughs> okay. Wait. Okay, it's starting already. <laughs> She put the question, man. You know what? Okay, I'm all for it. Uh, like girls going, being the one who initiated stuff. <sighs> Some girls have initiated the. Okay, most okay relationships were usually where in relationships where uh, the girl initiates. <laughs> Honestly, women. Some women don't know this, but they're starting at a low point. Now she's coming from a point where she wants she wants you and you you don't want her. It's like here's the thing. Another thing about relationships, they there's a dynamic that goes on there. So in that dynamic, it's actually in every type of relationship, in every type of relationship, it's like there's always one who seeks more attention than the other. So already she's starting at the point where she's the one who seeks the attention. And look at the guy. Look at look at look, look at his face, man. <laughs> okay, I don't know what's gonna happen. He might say yes, he might say no. But it's it's it feels a bit icky about it. It does. So he's kinda thinking about it. We'll see how it goes. Hello. Who are you and what are you doing here today? I'm Grace and I'm here to play truth or drink with my crush. <laughs> I haven't told him that I liked him before. I am gonna just take a big leap and ask him out. I really like him. <laughs> How do you Because <laughs> she really likes the guy. I don't know, man. <sighs> So okay, you, it's starting, but we already we see the pattern here. Yeah, that bring girls to tell guys that they like them. Usually, it's rare for a guy to say he doesn't like the girl when the girl is the one who says she likes him. Because of course, guys they don't have as many options as girls do. It's like that, but I think it's gonna go well. I think most of them are, are gonna go go well. Uh, Coming from that point of like, usually when girls ask out guys, guys really say no. We, we rarely say no. Like, I am gonna just take a big leap and ask him out. I really like him. You ready for me to bring him in? I'm ready. Let's do oh it. my gosh. <laughs> you know what? I find this one funny. I find this one funny. She has, she's one of those people who you'd say, okay, she's cute. If you like her, you'd say she's cute, but if you don't like her, she's gonna be annoying. It's either she's cute or she's annoying. There's no in-between with this one. She's not normal. She's either either cute or annoying. Yeah, let's see how it goes. I'm so ready. One minute, 12 seconds. Hi. Hello. Who are you and what are you doing here? Okay. I'm Skylar. I'm here because Emma invited me. And what kind of name is Skyla for a guy? <laughs> Who names a man? Who names a guy Skyla? That, 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 that's wrong. You shouldn't name your kid Skyla at all, man. Like, why? Skyla, I think Skyla is like, okay, I haven't, I haven't met any Skylas because I don't. Okay, I'm a black guy in South Africa. So. Only 9% of the population is white. So, it's not a lot of white. There's not, you can't. <laughs> I, haven't, I haven't seen a Skyler. And even the white people that I, I see, they're, they're like Africans, German, or whatever. There, there are no Skylers here in South Africa. So, a Skyler is it's an American name, of course, but Skyler, Skyler is a girl. I'm Kai. Pretty sure I'm just playing truth or drink. Is there a more American name than Kai? Like, is there, is, like, is there a more um, American name than Kai? Like, bruh, Kai is the most American guy ever. He's not, Kai is not even white or black or anything. He's just American. <laughs> Kai only exists within the bounds of America, but nowhere else, man. What is your favorite thing about our friendship? And what would you change? My favorite thing 
is the fact that it's so incredibly easy to talk to you. <laughs> okay. This is goes with the laugh. <laughs> this goes with the laugh again. You know, like that. There's a thing about that laugh. It's either cute or it's annoying. Like, if you like it, it's cute. If you don't, it's annoying. It can't. It can't go another way. It's, it's either like that. So um. <laughs> okay, this is a different experience, man. This is, okay, we'll be seeing how these people interact, and we're gonna we'll just be seeing how these people interact and see. I don't know, analyzing their body languages or whatever they say. So, for now, it seems like the guys are keen. Are keen. Okay, I saw some two lesbians. Two lesbians there. So two lesbians. Are they, are they lesbian? Or is, is, okay, it's either they're both lesbian or one is lesbian and she's asking the other friend who's like heterosexual. She's trying to ask her out. I will see if, if she's heterosexual. And I think she looks like she's lesbian. They both look like they're lesbian. Yeah. Let's just see how it goes. Favorite thing? Uh, I mean, it hasn't been that long, but you seem chill. <laughs> Is there like um, anything that stood out to you? I mean, your style for sure. I like it. Yeah. Uh, My favorite. Okay, here's one thing that he did good there. She asked him if he's seen anything interesting, right? So already she's seeking validation from the guy. Already she's seeking validation from the guy. And he decided to compliment her, her fashion sense. He says he likes her style. Like already it doesn't go to like the hypersexual, I like your lips, I like you're very beautiful, things like that. I could probably listen to you talk all day. <laughs> I don't know, you have very interesting stories and outlooks. I enjoy them. <laughs> okay, she's one too. She's already one. She's already one. Why? Because she likes it. They, they like each other. It's already they like each other, man. They like each other. I think maybe this thing is rigged. Yeah, is it possible that they might have like agreed to doing this thing back at home and they're like, okay, let's go act like <laughs> we've known each other for like so long for, for this much time and like, I think this one is going to be, it might be one of the longest relationships that's going to come out of this whole thing. Oh yeah. That would change that we don't hang out more, that we hang out more, not don't hang out more, hang out more. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, she really likes it. Bro, this one is a, this is a home run. It's home run already. Hang out more? Not don't hang out more. Hang out more. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay, rate my attractiveness on a scale of one to ten. Only ten? Damn, man, this guy is. <laughs> okay, if there, I heard there was a guy named Skyler, I think he's gay. I think he gave himself the name, and he's no. Skylar, you know what? I think Skylar is a transgender. If Skylar is a guy, I, th I think Sky. I just think I. I would think Skylar is a, is a transgender. <laughs> and already, <laughs> he's doing some corny stuff. She's. I think this is gonna be like one of those corny relationships. But they're both into it, so I, it's like <laughs> they can bo be both corny. Like it's. It's like they're giving each other permission to be corny. One's corny and the other is corny. So for them, it's like there's no corniness because the corniness cancels. If one was corny and the other one wasn't corny, it's gonna, it was going to be different. But since they're both corny, it's... The guy said only 10, man. <laughs> already he's trying to score points and already she's splashing. This is so on run too. Are you kidding me? Well, if it's only to 10, then I'd have to say 10. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Rate my attractiveness on a scale from 1 to 10. I mean, I, I don't see anything wrong with you. <laughs> okay, well, 1 to 10, you gotta put a number on it. <laughs> 9 point five. I don't know. So, Kai, Kai doesn't really care much. He's that guy. Kai is American, man. He's that American guy that doesn't really care much. He might be an artist or something. He's into art. You can see like them, like the shit and stuff. The tattoos is man. If you have if you have tattoos and you you don't have like that danger quality to you, you are usually an artist. 
usually an artist and she's she's also seeking validation what are my green flags you're always asking me how i am and it's like even though you have so much talent you're still so caring about everybody around you i like that a lot about you hmm. what are that's good but one thing that i've just seen is like these questions these questions were set up by professionals they were trust me they were they, these questions were set up by professionals because they're in a way trying to lure the other person in my green flags your presence like calms me down like you've never made me feel like anxious or like uncomfortable wow yeah. thank you that's so nice <laughs> what is on your sexual bucket list <gasps> <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna have to take a shot for that one. Okay. What's something I haven't tried? I think is the harder question. <laughs> you know what? I like I like these people really. You know what? Because they're they're a bit conserved when it comes to like revealing like these things. I don't like people who are like like talking about sexual things too much. It's just me though. Maybe it's just me, but I don't really like that much. Haven't tried, I think is the harder question. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I wanna just go to a like drive in theater and like be in the back of the car and have like the hood up. You know what I mean? And like kinda make okay, a she's a freak. She's a freak, she's revealed that there there hasn't been much that she hasn't done. You know what? That would be an ick for me. I don't wanna be I don't want to be with the girl and she says that like it's okay if it is the case but you don't have to announce it you don't have to like tell me that you've done everything that is to be done and like no man it's not i don't find it attractive i no, i don't i, I honestly don't <sighs> maybe it doesn't really care much maybe it's one of those who's looking forward to that in the back of the car. I think that'd be really cute. But I'm still on two shot. Sex on a beach like sounds cool <laughs> and I'm like very aware of all the drawbacks but I feel like you get like a private beach with your like room. Mm -hmm. Like that'd be totally rad. I mean and then like take a shower. <laughs> <laughs> no, sand on. This is one of the most cliche things. It's so cliche like a lot of people have said it and I haven't done it because they uh, man. Uh, yeah, and I'm, I don't live in the coast. I live in South Africa, but I don't live in the coast. And I'm like in the center of South Africa. So I haven't, I haven't really been. Maybe I'll go and see whatever. So yeah. Of all the drawbacks, but I feel like you get like a private beach with your like room. Mm -hmm. Like that'd be totally rad. I mean, and then like take a shower. <laughs> <laughs> no. Uh, there's something I'm, I'm gonna say about this girl. You might like it or my, you might not like it, but in case it's I made the video, so I'm. I don't like the sex in the beach girl, and it's not because of the sex in the beach. I I just don't like her voice. I, I, <laughs> I like I don't like her voice. It's it's one of those things you can tell. She has like the most Americanish accent. It's like uh, that. She has that like uh, I don't know. I just don't like her voice. I don't like her voice. I don't like how she looks. I don't like how she opens her mouth when she talks. I <laughs> Is it because she's lesbian? I don't think so. Because I like the other guy, the other girl, and she's kind of lesbianish. But I know that I don't, I definitely don't like her. What are your turn ons? Hmm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my yes. goodness. Oh, one. Good on you, Kai. Good on you, <laughs> Don't tell her. You are my ten ounces. No, you're gonna find out. I'm not telling you nothing. What are my ten ounces? Man, if some questions you don't you shouldn't answer, what are my ten ounces? Ah, maybe. If you're pretty sure she, she's gonna like the answer, but it, what if you're turned on by something that's freaky and you don't wanna reveal to her at this point? Ah <laughs> Okay, I think for me, it's since I'm, I'm pretty shy. I like girls that are forward, you know. Don't okay. make it a question. A little, sh a little shy boy. <laughs> of course. What are your turn-ons? Like the first, like touch. 
like like a hand on the thigh, you know, like where it, when it first when it's starting. Uh, I'm telling you, 100 percent of the time we try to put your your hand on a girl's thigh, she's definitely not <laughs> gonna. T it's definitely not gonna turn it on. 100 percent. I I promise you that. It's definitely not gonna turn it on. You have to slowly, like, it starts with the hands. You touch the hand and, like, you see how it goes. You touch, like, maybe the shoulder and see how it goes. You touch the elbow and see how it goes. It's kind of, it's like this. Hey, man. There's just so many things, man. A six or a seven, I would, like, rate myself. You know, it's less my skills and more, like, my attributes. Like, I have really nice lips. I have a tongue <laughs> ring. I, like, am really good with my tongue okay. as well. I'm pretty flexible. I'm pretty sold. I'm gonna say this again. I don't like it. <laughs> I don't know which says it has nice lips. Not their lips. I don't know. How many white people have nice lips? How many white guys have nice lips, honestly? Ah, man, that lips are too thin for my liking. Yeah, but I don't like it. One thing I'm sure of, I don't like that guy. I don't know why. I just don't like it. I don't like her voice. I don't I don't know. I'm a sexual deviant. Okay. <laughs> if a girl tells you she's a sexual deviant, bro, she's definitely a sexual deviant. Like 100%. Skylar, I really like you. <laughs> Take a look at his face, man. <laughs> man, that hit him off guard. It, it, like, it hit him off guard for me. You might like it, but it did hit him off guard. And I wanted to know if you wanted to date me, like you could be my person and I could be yours. Yes. Are you kidding me? It, I'm surprised this is a question because yes, most definitely. Really? A hundred percent. I really like you. I really like you. Man, this man says a hundred percent, but look at his eyes, man. Look, <laughs> but look at this man's eyes. Do they say a hundred percent? More like sixty percent. Like I, I don't know what this guy is thinking. Bruh, this guy might be just going in it. Like, maybe. Uh, man, man, if it happens, it's gonna be one of the most corny relationships, man. It's uh, it's gonna be corny. They're gonna be like the typical corny American relationship. I have a little bit of a crush on you, and um, I was wondering if you felt the same. Um, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, I haven't really been dating anyone in a minute, so it's kind of good time. Yeah, I'm just nervous. <laughs> ah, my guy. Guy is the most American like guy. Is is the. He's, he's an awkward American guy, <laughs> but he's an awkward guy. <laughs> Here we go. There's so many cards. So oh, more cards. Here we go. I have a boyfriend. <laughs> I go. I have a boyfriend. <laughs> She's so excited, man. That girl is so excited, bro. She's so excited. Green is so excited. Why didn't you tell me until today? <laughs> <laughs> I think the main uh, big thing probably is that like I haven't been like in a relationship with a woman, so it's um Okay. She hasn't been in a relationship with a woman, which means she's been straight her whole, her whole life pretty much. Hmm. She hasn't been in a relationship with a woman. Maybe she's had one night stand with a woman, but I don't know how these things go. But Already, she doesn't have experience dating women. That one does. So, I think she's turning her into a, like a full time lesbian. So, <laughs> maybe that's why I don't like it. She's turning in all these girls, all these kind girls into lesbians. Maybe that's why. <laughs> like, I'm trying to find like the reason why I don't like her, but maybe it's just their voice. Maybe it's just that symbol. We need to hang out. Yeah. We'll go to a drive-in theater. Oh, yeah? <laughs> Cross them off your bucket list? <laughs> I mean, if you're down. <laughs> I like movies. 
Shut up. <laughs> that was my whole ploy for the day. Yes. Oh my God. Not the handshake. No, you gotta, oh, okay. <laughs> what if we go and do some karaoke at the bar? What's the song that you really want to sing with me? Just ain't no mountain high enough over and over and over again. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you harmonize. That's so sexy. I want to do you. <laughs> Okay, this this girl, she, this girl is uh, 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 She said she was she's a sexual deviant. She definitely is a sexual deviant. I dare you two to kiss to seal the deal. Yeah? You wanna kiss? Wait, wait. There we go. Okay, here's the thing about this relationship. I'm not sure how long it's gonna last. And this one might not last as much as the other ones. You know why? Because girls don't like doing that for a long time. They can only seek validate the guy's validation for, uh, for a, a, a specific period of, t of time. Unless if the guy has something really going about him. So unless if this guy has really something going about him, this is gonna... Because uh, she can't keep this thing going. Because they ask them to kiss, right? She said, kiss, I, I dare you, to, okay, the person who's hosting said, I dare you to kiss to seal the deal. And the girl asked the guy if they could kiss. And then she's the one who reached forward. Bruh, she's seeking, she, she's really reaching out for the guy. She, she's really reaching out. And throughout this whole thing, she's the one who's been reaching out the most out of everybody. So, <laughs> I don't know how long that's going to last. Because like in a relationship, it's gonna be it has to be a push pull. Like you both, you kind of like you push, you you push a bit and see how the other one acts. You push a bit and like if you're the one who keeps on pushing, then uh, she's gonna end up getting bored. She's gonna end up feeling annoyed and like the time when someone like gives her that validation and she doesn't have to like seek it, it's gonna be a wrap for Kai. <laughs> So like and subscribe until next time folks.